Okay, so guys, uh, our last topic yesterday is about the adding and subtracting a rational algebraic expression. Again, what is rational again, guys? Rational is the form of P over U. Or simply, yes, rational is a form of fraction. So, fraction po siya, but ang Q po natin is not equal to zero. So, hindi po pwedeng mag equal to zero ang ating Q or ang ating denominator. Why? Because po, magiging extraneous po ang ating Q. Because hindi po tayo pwedeng magiging, like for example, 1 over 0. Okay, so nag-0 po ating denominator. This is not an example of rational algebraic expression. Okay, always remember that Q or the denominator is not equal to 0. Again, next, adding is the form of addition. Subtracting, okay, you subtract the number or you, min you minus the number. Then like with like denominators, so meaning ang ating denominator is the same value. Like for example, um, 2 over 3x plus 5 over 3x. So guys, Na ba, mapapansin mo po guys is our denominator are same value. They are same constant and they are same variable. So ang gagawin nyo po dyan is only copy the denominator. Okay, copy the denominator is 3x and add the numerator. So where is our numerator? Here the upper number or the upper part of our ratio. So, the upper part is the 2 and 5. So, add the 2 and 5. So, 2 plus 5 is equal to 7 over 3x. So, this is our final answer. Okay? So, copy the denominator. Okay, 3x, then add the numerator, which is the 2 plus 5 is 7. Okay, so may tanong po dito. Do you have any question? Do you have any question, class? Okay, so wala po. Okay, that's, that's another example. So, how about in subtracting or subtraction with like denominator or similar denominator? They are the same denominator. So, uh, 5x plus 10x. Okay, so 8x plus 10x. So, subtraction. Okay. So, guys, if you subtract, look at the denominator. So, they are both the same, 10x. They are same coefficient and they are same variable. So, all you have to do is copy the denominator. So, 10x. Okay? So, next, proceed to the numerator. The numerator is the 5x and the 8x. Okay? So, if 5x minus 8x, what is that? 5 minus 8? How many, guys? 5 minus 8. Negative? Negative 3 po. Okay, very good. So, negative, then x minus x is still x. Okay, so don't forget, guys, if you add the two no, the two variables, 
if you add the two variable, x plus x is equal still x. Then if you multiply the two variable, like example, x multiplied by x, our answer is x raised of 2 or x squared because you add the exponent. So 1 plus 1 is 2. Okay po? So same, same guys. If you, if you subtract x minus x is still x. Like for example here, so 5x minus 8x is negative 3x. Okay, so this is our final answer. Since hindi na po natin siya pwedeng ma-simplify. So may lowest term pa po ba siya? Negative 3 and 10? Hindi na po natin siya pwedeng ma-lowest term. Next. So, what if, guys, if our subtraction is not y squared over y minus 2? Okay, so minus y squared plus 16y over y minus 2. Okay, so guys, in subtraction, we have a rule. Okay, so subtraction, we have a rule. Don't forget the rule that the rule of the subtraction is change the sign of the subtrahend. Okay, so where is the subtrahend? Is it the equation A or equation B? Where is the subtrahend? Equation B. Yes, very good. So, our equation B is our subtrahend. Okay, so the rule of the subtraction is change the sign. Okay, so let's proceed. Since we have the same denominator, then copy y minus 2. Okay, so y minus 2, copy. Then 9y, copy. Okay, so see, here is our subtrahend. So change mo siya. Ang y squared na positive magiging negative y squared. Ang 16, positive 16, magiging negative Ah, yes po. Negative 16y. Okay, so mapapasig yun guys. Ang y natin is positive. Then, change ko po na sign naging negative. Positive 16, nag-change yung sign, naging negative 16. Okay po, take note po yan. Ang ating subtrahen, i-change the sign nyo po siya. Okay, next. So simplify guys. Okay, copy nyo po yung, yung denominator. Then simplify. So y squared, 9y squared, and negative y squared. So since they are unlike sign, positive and negative. So ano po gagawin natin pagka unlike sign? So copy the sign. I'd copy the variable y squared. So, positive 9, min, uh, positive 9 and negative 1. So, follow the bigger sign, which is the positive. And 9 minus 1 is 8. Okay po? So, 9 minus 1 is 8. Then, follow the bigger sign. The bigger sign is the positive 9. Okay. So, 8y squared and the left is negative 16y. Okay, so guys, pwede pa po ba itong ma-simplify? Pwede pa bang ma-simplify? May factor pa po ba? Pwede pa bang ma-factor siya? Okay, so pwede pa siyang ma-factor guys. Pwede siya ma-factor gamit ng 
y minus 2. Okay, so i-factor natin. Paano ba ang pag-factor? Since 16, what is the factor of 16? 1 times 16. Okay, 8 times 2. Very good. So, 8 times 2 ang factor ng ating 16. Okay, so 8y over y minus 2. Over y minus 2. Okay, so 8 times y, 8y times y is 8 squared. 8y times negative 2 is negative 16y. Then, Happy the denominator, okay? So, makikita nyo po ang ating denominator and numerator. They are the same negative y minus 2. So, we can cancel this. Then, after you cancel, ano po yung natira? Is only 8y. So, our final answer is 8y. Okay, so may tanong po ba tayo dito? Any clarification, guys? Nope. Wala po. Malinaw po. So, proceed to next topic po. Okay na po ba? Okay. So, next our topic is the adding the adding and subtracting Okay, so same topic, adding and subtracting of rational algebraic expression. But guys, uh, this time, with with the similar Okay, with unlike Okay, so yung first na sinol po natin is same vari same denominator, but this time mag-add tayo and magsusubtract tayo, pero hindi na po magkaparehas ang ating denominator. They are not the same. Okay? Or dissimilar po sila. Hindi po sila magkaparehas. So, example po. Okay. Sa so, fraction, like for example, 3 over 4 plus 2 over 3. Okay. So, guys, take note, guys. Ang ating denominator are not the same. They are 4 and 3. Okay. So, hindi po natin sila pwedeng ipagsama. Only thing, only, ang, ang, ang pwede natin gawin is kunin po natin kanilang LCD. So, paano makukuha ang LCD? Is through the LCM. Least common multiple. So, kunin po natin yung LCD nila sa 4 and sa 3. Okay, so for three, since 3 is 1 times 3, right? 1 times 3, ang LCD po is 3. Then so 4, ang ating ano po sa so 4 is 2 times 2. Okay po? Since hindi ko po sila pinagpapat, kasi 2 and 2. Okay, so kunin po natin LCD. So, bring down lang po natin si 1, and si 3, and si 2, and si 2. Okay? So, i-multiply lang po natin sila. 1 times 3 is 3, times 2, ilan po, 6, times 2 is 12. Okay, so ang LCD po nila is 12 because 1 times 3 times 2 times 2 is 12. Okay, so ayan po, ang LCD is 12. Or simply yes, pwede nyo po siyang i-multiply. 4 times 3 is 12. Okay po, 
So, hindi po lahat ng time na pwede natin i-multiply. So, mas better pa po na ganito na lang yung gawin natin para makuha ang, makuha ang LCD. Gumamit po kayo ng this common multiple. So, i-multiply nyo po siya or i-factor nyo po yung number. Next. Okay, since may LCD na po tayo ng 12. Okay, so 12. Okay, dito na lang po natin ilagay. 12. Okay, so ano na po natin? 12 divided by 4. How many? 12 divided by 4 is? Hello guys? 12 divided by 4 is? 3. So 3 times 3. Uh, divided by 4 is 3 times 3 is 9. Okay po. So 12 divided by 4 is 3 times 3 is 9. Next, 12 divided by 3. How many? 12 divided by 3 is 4. Okay. Times 2 is 8. Again, 12 divided by 3 is 4 times 2 is 8. So next, so since same na po sila ng denominator, pwede na po natin silang i-add. Okay? So proceed to the adding. Okay. So same, same denominator, copy, then proceed the 9 plus 8. So 9 plus 8, guys. 9 plus 8. Guys, 9 plus 8 17. is 17. So, this is our answer. 17. Okay. So, same din po siya sa subtraction. So, guys, ito po is addition. Okay. Proceed po tayo kay subtraction. Pwede na po bang ilipat sa next slide? Are you still copying? Okay, patams up na lang po kung pwede ko ng in slide. Okay. So guys, example po dito sa subtraction. So subtraction with like denominator. Hindi po sila magkaparehas na denominator. So 4 minus 5. Ay, 4 over 5 minus one point. So, next, ang gagawin po natin dito is kunin po natin ang kanilang LCD. So, para makuha natin ang LCD, gagamit po tayo ng LCM, the least common multiple. Mumultiply po natin yung 5. Ito po yung mga dinaminan natin, yung 5 and 4. Okay, so ano ba yung least common multiple ng 5? So, 1 times 5, right? Meron pa bang ibang number? Okay, so wala na. So ano ba yung least common multiple ng 4? 4 is 2 times 2. Okay, so 2 times 2. Then next, i-bring down nyo po sila. So 1 times 5 times 2 times 2. Okay, so 1 times 5 times 2 times 2, ilan po yan? 1 times 5 is 5, times 2 is 10, times 2 is 20. Okay po, 20. So our LCD is 20. So the simplest is 5 times 4 is equal to 20. So ganun na lang po kung ano po. Okay, so meron po tayo 20 na denominator. Okay, so let's proceed. 20 divided by 5. 20 divided by 5 is 4. So 4 times 4 is how many? 
How many po? 16. 16. Okay, next. 20 divided by 4 is 5. 5 times 1 is? 5. Good. So next, since there is the same denominator, copy. By 16 plus 5 is? And 16 minus 5, sorry. So, subtraction po tayo, hindi na siya plus. Okay, so 16 minus 5 is? Ilan po? 11. Okay. So, 11 over 20. So, this is our final answer. So, guys, uh, number pa lang po to. Yeah, pinati siya sa rational algebraic expression. So, pag sinabi po natin rational algebraic expression, may kasama na po siyang mga expression. Like example, yung mga x, y, mga variable po natin. So, try po natin. 10 over 3x cube. Okay? So, kunin po muna natin yung mga denominator nila. So, 2 over 6x squared y. Okay, so paano po ba kunin ang LCD? Ito po doon. Kunin natin yung LCD nila. So meron tayong 3x squared and 6x squared y. Yan po. So get the LCD. So bago makuha yung LCD, gumawa tayo ng LCM, the least common multiple. Okay, so what is the LCD of 3x? Since yung number niya is 3, so 1 times 3. Okay, so dalawang x, since x squared po siya, dalawang x, so 1, 2. Dalawang x na po. So next, yung 6, ano po yung factor ng 6? Is 2 times 3, right? 2 times 3 is 6. Okay, so may dalawa pa tayong x, x squared. So, x times x. Next, meron po tayong isang y. So, isang y. Okay, so naano na po natin ang ating... Okay, so yan. So, guys, i-bring down na po natin siya, guys. Bring down na po natin. So, hindi ko po ipagtatapat si Okay, si X Si 1 is nandito po. Yan. Okay, so bring down na po natin. I-bring down natin si 1. Bring down natin si 2. Since they are same 3, okay, bring down na lang natin si 3. Okay, bring down mo si X. Since dalawa silang X, Isa na lang po yung kukunin natin. Tandaan nyo guys, once na lang po yung kukunin natin. Next, X, bring down mo si X, and Y. Okay? So next, 1, 1 times 2 times 3. Okay, so dalawang X po siya is X squared and Y. So 1 times 2 times 3 is, ilan po? 1 times 2 times 3? 6. 6. So, 6x squared y. So, our LCD is 6x squared y. Okay, so, okay, overtime na po tayo. For O2 na pala po. Okay. So, guys, okay na po. Tapusin ko lang po to, guys. So, malapit naman na po. Okay. So, yan po ang ating Oh, why? Why, Leonard? Tawa ng tawa si Leonard. Okay. So, yan po. Kinakausap po niya. kasi siya ni Sir Errol. I see. Okay. Nag-overtime na po ata tayo. Okay. So, guys. Um, Iano ko na lang po to, guys. Pa, may next klase pa ata kayo. Uh, let's continue ko na lang po to sa other day. Okay. So, I hope po na... Any question ba, guys? Any question po ba tayo? Okay. Not so, pa-open na lang. 
Okay, pa-open na lang po ng mga camera po natin, guys. Ayan. So, ready po. Smile po tayo, guys. Ha? Okay, ready. One, two, three. Smile. Okay, bye-bye po. Ingat po.